everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here with my reborn babies. My nursery isn't completely finished, so I have not done a tour of it yet, but I will soon. They're all just kind of like behind me so you can see them. But I want to do a video of what I keep in my diaper bag for my reborn. So this diaper bag was sent to me from one of you awesome people, and I filled it with some like generic stuff that'll always be in there. And of course, if I like ever take it out, I'll like fill it with stuff that is actually like that I can use mittens as jumping around and stuff. She's like, come here, come say, come say hi. But um, I can always change it if I need to, but this is like generic stuff that'll always be in it. And I just thought that it'd be nice to show you what I keep in my diaper bag. So let's get started. So this is a Graco diaper bag. Again, I'm sorry if mittens gets in the way. So this is Graco. So in this front pocket right here, I have a Swaddle Me which was also sent by the same person who sent the bag. But this is an elephant swaddle me. It's gender neutral, which I really like. So then any of my babies can use it. And I just thought I'd put a swaddle me in here because if it gets cold or something, I don't need a blanket, I'll just use a swaddle me. And in this one, I actually don't know why, but I just have these sunglasses. <laughs> but um, I don't have any pacifiers in here because all my babies take different pacifiers. So depending on who I take out, I'll put in different pacifiers. In the side pocket over here, I have two bottles. This one is gender neutral. It's a Dr. Brown's bottle, and it says, I love you. And so this one's really cute. I sealed a ton of bottles recently. So you have to like press it, and then the milk will come. So we have this one, Dr. Brown's. We have this honest one, and it's green. So these are two gender neutral bottles, and I just thought that I'd have two because you never know which ones you're gonna need. And I can always change them based on which babies are coming. Cause like for Landon, neither of these are really suitable for him. And for Laura, I'd obviously want like a sippy cup. And for um, Caleb, I probably want something smaller. So I just kind of, these are just like basic ones that if I really just needed to grab it and go, I could. So in this side, I have this little Pampers thing and it has a pack of wipes in it. There's six little tiny wipes in here. This is like a sample packet thing. I have a bunch of different diapers in different sizes. So I have this one's a size two. This one's a size one Huggies. Girl newborn. I should really put a preemie in here. And I have like a boy or gender neutral newborn. And I should really put a preemie in here. I don't have any of Laura's diapers in here either. But I just have a few diapers in the pocket. So then in the back, this is where the changing mat is. So. It's just like your basic little changing pad. You can just lay it down and put the baby on it. So I have that in the back, because that's where it like belongs. I'm really excited about a diaper bag, by the way. <laughs> and then in the top part, this is like magnetic buttons. So in the back right here, this is, it's like a, this blanket, but it's actually one that goes over your stroller. And so you can hook these ties up to the um, handles and the bottom like near the wheels of the stroller and then it like covers the baby so I don't usually take out a stroller because the only one I have is Laura's but I am planning on getting a travel system soon so that'll be helpful for that and I can also just use it as a regular blanket if I needed to so I feel like that's good for like multi-task like multi-purpose and then in this part on the other side this is like a giant bag it's like a one size thing and it's like basically instead of a blanket, um, it's gender neutral. I can just, the baby goes in here and then it's like a thing that keeps them warm because it won't like come undone because they're like in it, like a onesie basically. And then I just have some generic things. Like these are some socks that are gray. I thought those were really nice and gender neutral because any baby can wear them. Then I have these little mittens. I thought these ones were pretty gender neutral because they're just kind of animals and I think girls or boys could wear them. They're a little bit more boyish, but either could wear them. And then I have two bibs, a girl bib and a boy bib. Here's a girl bib. It says beautiful in every way. And then the boy bib has a bear and it says bear hugs. Then I have a few gender neutral outfits. So this one's three to six months. And so that's really cute. It's like a nice, um, I think this one's very gender neutral. It just has some nice sweet little colors and they look really cute. And then this one's a three month one. It just has some drafts on it, also very gender neutral. And so I need the babies to wear that. And then I have this newborn one with gray turtles on it, and also very gender neutral. I don't have anything 
in like Caleb's size or Owen's size or Laura's size, but I feel like some of those babies I wouldn't always take out. So I kind of just thought about the sizes that I would take out. So like this would be like Raylan or Ryan. This would be like Shane or Landon. And this could also work for Shane or Landon, but I don't know why I put that one in there. I just kind of did. That's everything that I keep in my diaper bag. And like I said, um, this is just kind of like a basic and like if I just need to grab it and run, that's kind of what this is for. But if I'm like planning, then I'll actually put stuff in here that I feel like would be better like per the baby. Like if I'm taking Raylan, I'd put in bottles that would work for her and like girly bottles. And I put in like some of her pacifiers and outfits for her and like specific stuff towards that baby. But this is just like my basic, like just keep that stuff packed. And that's just how I feel like it's best just to keep it packed that way. So anyways, thank you all so much for watching. Please click like and subscribe and in the comments, let me know if you think there's anything I should add to the diaper bag just to keep as like a generic thing to keep in there. And we'll see you guys later. Bye.